So the first thing you're gonna do is you're going to oh, I don't know what I do. <laughs> I'm gonna go on Canva and the first one is Canva amazingly simple graphic software. Um and you go on custom dimensions and the width <coughs> is nine twenty and the height is ten eighty. This is the size of a YouTube screen. You just press design and it will load. So once it's loaded, you go on upload. You can upload your own image from like copy and paste um, images from the internet and use them as your background like I've got. But I've already downloaded one that I want to use. So you just like size it to um, where you want it. So the size of the actual um screen and you go on shapes and the middle one the top line is the um one that you use so you have to like cut it down to size and this is where the um video for your end card is going to um be so you kind of just resize it and then um i'm going to go into uploads and this is like the size like a smaller version, but it's like the size of how big the video is going to be. So I'll just make it that width. There's a line comes down through the middle sometimes. Um, that shows you, um, like how in the middle it is. And then after I've done that, um. I just chuck that to the side and put it like in the thing and then you can see the line comes again and so now this is exactly in the middle. So I'm going to drag it down a bit so I can fit all the other um, stuff onto my um, video. So I've got uh, the this font, um, it's the top one, it's called Ice Cream Party and I'm just uh, deleting all the writing on that. Um, and I'm going to put on here Hannah's wait Hannah's apostrophe S lifestyle because that's obviously my YouTube name and um, then I will move that to the top and then if you want it on the center then have it on the center and then it makes it more even you can change it different angles or stuff like that um i think what font uh size should i go for yeah i think i'll go 32 and then i'm gonna go change the color to um i might i probably want to go for a light color actually i'll choose white yeah i'll choose white um so i, I just put that at the top so i can Add other things in. So now I'm going to get a different font. Um, the complete thing. Um, and I'm just going to delete all the other little image. Um, image. The ev all the other bits of writing around it. And then I'm going to put my Instagram. So obviously it's just H201. And I'm kind of make it bigger so I can drag it a bit easier there we go right dragging it and then at top I've still got a bit of writing I'm just gonna take that off and then here I why is that not getting bigger hmm oh I know why I haven't highlighted it right I haven't highlighted it highlighted it right uh, 16 I'm going to put that font at um, size that for letters and I think I might change the font yeah I will I'm going to change the font to the same as the um, title and um, <coughs> and um, um, so I'm just going to put my Snapchat, Dorothy225, um, and then just size it like that. 
I'm going to change the font to the same as the title as well. Move the box around and then I'm going to type up YouTube, um, so like the YouTube logo. That's a bit thick. I'm going to like resize it and then put it just like down underneath um, my social medias. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, the next thing is I just like um, moving it a bit because I'm going to put both of their logos on there. So if you want, this is how you get on to like getting the stuff. So I'm just going to type in Snapchat. And then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to click on image, click on images, and then you can choose between, like, there's all the yellow ones with different backgrounds and different Snapchat images and stuff like that. I don't really like any of these, so I think, mm, I like the dog one. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to type Snapchat PNG, what's already there, um, and I'm going to choose that one because um, I kind of like the ones that don't have any colour to it. Um, it kind of stands out a bit more, I feel like. It might not to you guys, but I'm just going to put that on mine. So, so, um, I'm going to now put in Insta, okay, short, and I'm going to get the same type of one but obviously the like, different logo, and I'm just going to name that too. So, now I'm going to do that. Instagram one. No. And now I'm just going to put both of them on there, and then, like, uh, for the Instagram one, I'm going to crop it to make it not have the white stuff in the back. It's quite easy. This website is a really nice site just to get used to making thumbnails and different ideas because it kind of helps you and it's really quite easy. If you haven't seen my last video, how I edit my videos, um, you definitely should go watch that because that will maybe help you out too for your YouTube channel. And Windows Movie Maker that I edit on is free and I left a link in the description from my from my how I edit my videos. Um, how the page that I downloaded off. So I'm just gonna like put that in the middle to make sure it's like sizing is right. So after I've done that, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm gonna leave that right. So after I've done that, I'm gonna go on to <coughs> uh. So that is what you need, the PowerPoint presentation. But now I'm going to go on to download. And I'm going to download this as a GPG, depending on what type of file your computer has or what you what suits your computer best. Um, I um, use GPG because it saves it. And um, I like to do that. So once I've done that, I'm going to go on to PowerPoint. And I'm going to try, what I normally do is I just go on to normal documents. Oh, it's not on there. Where is it? I'm going to download it again, because I think what happened is I have to click on it to make it verified as something that's gone on to my documents. Right. So after that, Come on, hold tight, preparing a design. Right, that's done. Now I'm just going to click on it. Make sure to click on the thing and then cross. Because I think that's what's ruining it for my one. Right, I'm just going to close that because I'm going to go into that document. Ah. And I'm going to drag it and put it onto there. Um, After that, you go on insert and then you go on video. Um, I've got my videos on my PC, so 
I think I'm not gonna choose all the favorites because I used that for all my other ones. But I think I'll choose Expectation versus Reality Christmas, um, because I quite like that video. I like doing all the skits with my friend. So this it's inserting the media to make it easier to edit, and this is what you have to do, like loading it onto the page. When it comes big, quite big on the screen, so you kind of just need to file that down. And then I'm going to make it to the size of like the outline of the um, the little um, black lines on the outside. So now that has been like done the outline, you're going to go on to playback and you go trim video. So, um, instead of your video being four minutes, or however long it is, you're going to shorten it to about 16, 20 seconds long. So it's got a little snippet of your video, so it's kind of like a bit like a trailer. And then you press OK, and then I'm going to play you for it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be an expectations versus reality. But as you can see, I'm wearing a Christmas hat, so it's got to be Christmas themed. So, so after you have done that, you're going to go to file and then you're going to go save as. Um, I'm going to use Hannah's videos because it will be better on there because it's like a type of video. And I'm just going to put end to video 3. Um, save. Just saving. I bet this will lag. Yep. It's not responding, but it's kind of the same. It will definitely work, as you can see that it's already on my documents. So that was the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. Welcome to today's video. So today's video, um, today's video is going to be an August solo first.